UK Visitor Visa, Top 7 Frequently Asked Questions In today's video update, we will talk about UK Visitor Visa. Please keep in mind that, most visitors to the UK will be obligated to submit an application for a UK Visit Visa from their country of residence, before coming to the UK. In this video update, we will answer some of the questions, that are most frequently asked by our subscribers on the comments section, who want to visit the UK as a standard visitor, for the intention of tourism or leisure. Changing the rules on immigration. A new immigration bill. Points-based immigration system. Brightest and the best. Greatest place to live. Let's begin the video and tell you about the eligibility requirements for a UK visitor visa application. Please keep in mind that, in making an application for a UK visitor visa, you will be needing to prove the following. You will depart from the UK at the end of your visit. You will not reside in the UK for extended times through frequent or consecutive visits or make the UK your main home. You are able to sustain yourself and your dependents during your trip. You are able to pay the expenses for your return or onward tour. You have an evidence of any business or other activities you desire to do in the UK as permitted by the visitor rules. What can you do as a standard visitor in the UK? As a visitor to the UK for the intention of tourism or leisure, you will be allowed to do the following. Visit friends and family and come to the UK for a vacation. Opt in educational exchanges programs. Appear at recreational courses for a maximum of 30 days. Volunteer with a listed charity for a maximum of 30 days. How much funds do you need to show for a UK visitor visa? You must have approach to adequate resources to uphold yourself sufficiently for the duration of your visit to the UK. There is no fixed level of funds you need to show at this stage. Some attention must be given to the activities you plan to take on and your living expenditures in the UK. This is because, when evaluating your visit visa application, a caseworker will think through the likely cost of your stay and measure any source of income that will carry on to be available to you whilst visiting the UK. A caseworker will take into consideration your earnings or savings against any financial pledges you have in your country of residence in deciding whether you are able to finance yourself monetarily during your visit to UK. How can you make an application for a UK visitor visa? An application for a UK visitor visa need to be made online. A standard visitor may apply for a visit visa of 6 months, 2.5 years, or 10 years validity. This permits multiple visits to the UK within the period of validity if the visit visa is permitted a single or dual entry, but if it is a multiple entry visa, you still will be unable to remain in the UK as a visitor for over 6 months on any individual visit to the UK. As part of the UK Visit Visa application process, you will be obligated to attend a visa centre to submit your biometrics and have your passport scanned as part of the application process. After your application form is submitted online, you will be able to upload your supporting credentials online and book an appointment to enroll your biometrics. How much does it cost to make a UK Visit Visa application? The UK Home Office application fee for a standard visitor visa is £95. You may be required to pay an additional fee for a biometric appointment at a visa centre. How long will it take for a UK visit visa application to be processed? An application for a UK visitor visa is generally decided inside three weeks of making the application and attending a visa application centre. It may be likely to apply for a priority service to accelerate the visa application process depending on the country you are applying from. Because of the COVID-19 pandemic, there may be delays in processing your visit visa applications 
and priority services may be restricted. Lastly, let's tell you what happens if your application for a UK visitor visa is refused. The bad news is that you are not likely to have a right of appeal if your application for a standard visitor visa is refused. If you need to challenge a UK visit visa refusal, it is probable you will have to do so by means of judicial review. For more information, you may to speak to your nearest barristers for expert legal advice on making a fresh visit visa application after the refusal of your UK visitor visa. It will be vital for you to make a cautiously prepared application which tackles each reason from your refusal to be addressed with the intention of succeeding with a fresh application. Today's video ends here. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment below. Thanks for watching today's update.